previously on Heavy Rain. Dad! <laughs> hey, Dad! take it easy, you're gonna knock me over. Kinda looks like, uh, so kind of like a weird type huh? of Zag Braff right there. Am I grown up now? Hmm, 10 years old, that's not exactly grown up, but you're getting there. Where's Jason? He was here a second ago, I bought him a balloon, I turned around and he just disappeared. Disappeared? What do you mean disappeared? Stay here, I'll go get him. Stupid does not Look at that lady. Jason! How does he die if dad puts himself there? Look at Sean. Can I have his toys? <laughs> I'd give anything if you could come back to life. You know, Sean, there's some things which just have to happen. Even if you don't want them to. It's not fair, Dad. It's not fair. Hey guys, it's Albert Sisman, and we are here with some more heavy rain. Right here, we just picked up Sean, so we're gonna get in the car and head out. Uh, so let's head out. Sean doesn't sleep too happy. His brother died a year ago. I think it was a year ago. And uh, it's funny, like, when you see uh, Ethan pick up Sean, you see other parents that are around there, and you see other par parents with umbrellas for their ch ch child, their children. Ethan didn't have an umbrella for his ch Sean, so I don't know. Right now, he's not in a good spot. So we feel bad for Ethan right now. He lost his son, and he's not doing too well. And I'm still allergies are kicking it, guys. Sorry, my voice sounds weird. But I had to do a video for you guys. I had to do. I wasn't going to. I was like, you know what? I don't feel good. I I feel like shit. But I had to do a video for you guys. So here you are. <coughs> I actually had to do this all over again. Because I don't know when the game saves. I guess it didn't save. Because I had to do the pre, uh, the prologue all over again. Like at the beginning, wake up in the house before on Jason night. I had to do all that over again. Which was a pain in the butt. I like how the city looks. You know, it's darkish grayish. Uh, plus the rain makes helps it out. It's just beautiful. It's really, really beautiful. And if you can tell, we don't live at the house anymore, so that tells you something happened between uh, Ethan and his wife. Uh, you don't know yet in the story, but you can put two to two together. He has his own place now. And the relationship between Sean and Ethan isn't going too well either. There's a lot of not talking, a lot of quietness. So you can tell both of them, Ethan and Sean, there's a lot of stuff going in that we still don't know. So let's talk to him. Let's break the ice ourselves. So, do you want to talk a little? Talk about what? I don't know, about you, your friends, how things are going. Nothing special. See, so it doesn't sound like he's very happy, and obviously you, can, you can't blame him, his brother died. Uh, how are things at school? Is your teacher nice? Everything's fine, Dad. Okay. Two weeks. Sean hasn't done his homework yet. I wrote a reminder note on the board in the kitchen. It's time for your snack. Are you hungry? I guess, uh, a little. Let's see what we can find in the kitchen. So let's make him a little snack. We got a pizza. Does that consider a snack? Uh, I'm always drinking orange juice. Yeah, let me look at the little wall note that he has, because I think he has a certain times. Put the damn thing down. He has certain times that he wants Sean to do things. I forgot where it's at, though. What time is it? It's 5 o'clock. Where's his little note paper thing? Oh, it's right there. 4.30 snack. We fucked up that already. 6 homework, 7 dinner, bed. Let's, get, let's see if we can get him an apple for a snack.
Here, Sean. Here's your snack. Thanks, Dad. So good with Apple as a snack. We're being a good dad. What's five? What was the next thing? Homework? At six, he has to do homework. So right now it's 510. So let's look around the house. The time goes on down pretty fast. Let's get some fresh air, get wet a little bit. So this backyard, if you can tell, it's not the same like his house's backyard. It's the opposite. It's dead. Like Ethan is inside. Okay, R1. L1. And shoot. Shoot. That's all. Nothing but net. There's no net, but you know what I mean. Let's do one more, and then let's go uh, tell e uh, Sean to do his homework. Beautiful. Now that I don't have a wife, I might uh, start my career in NBA. No, that's it. We're done showing off in front of our neighbors that are not looking. All right, let's head back inside and see if it's six o'clock already, and give Sean, or make Sean do his homework. And he better not give me attitude, or I'll get him killed too. Well, let's go check. I think it's no, it's 5:30. Yeah, we can still snoop around. What's over here? Can I use the restroom? No. That's the most depressing freaking restroom I've ever seen in my life. This whole house is depressing. There's nothing over here? What's that? Ooh, I left some stuff in the dryer. That Sean's moving too much. Uh, where, should, where else can we go? Let's go upstairs. I, I just don't want to waste a lot of time, guys. When you start messing up the time of uh, what certain uh, things you want Sean to do, it gets messy. Huh? I don't know what that means. He's getting sick? He has allergies like me! That's my son. Wait, 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 what are we getting? No, I thought you were get the medicine. Let's be a good dad. Give him the medicine. I can't get him medicine? Yeah, I can't give him medicine, so... Fuck you, Sean. You ain't getting shit. Oh, that's, look, that's the sketch you, that you do. Uh, like I said, once I started doing, I started the pre uh, prologue again, I actually did that sketch in his house. So that's why you can see it there. If you wouldn't have done it, I don't think there would have been anything there. Hey, stop messing around or I'll never be able to film you. What do you want me to do? I don't know. Oh, yeah, Jason, tell me what you want to be when you grow up. Uh, I don't know. Maybe a fireman or an astronaut. Oh, wait, wait, I know. I'll be a dinosaur hunter. I'll make video games. And here's the most beautiful mother in the whole wide world. Oh, well, Ethan, <laughs> stop. Don't film me. I can't you watch this anymore. Like it. It's too depressing. You're right, Ethan. We're here with you, man. Let's go tell Sean to do his homework now. I'll go downstairs. Okay, I'm not gonna even look at the time. I'm just gonna tell him to do his homework. If he gives me attitude, he's getting a whooping. Sean, do you want to do your homework now? Please, Dad, let me watch TV a little while longer. We'll do it later, okay? 
Now! I think we should just get right to it. Then it's done and out of the way. Now, get your bag and get set up in the kitchen. He's like, I'll I, help you. He's like, I hate your dad. You're the worst dad ever. You got my brother killed. Oh shit, it's about to be seven. Get out of my way, Sean! Dinner at seven. All right, let's get dinner ready, guys. Okay, I can't open that. Yeah, I can't do anything else. I guess I have to wait till he's done homework. <coughs> Let's watch him do his homework. But his allergies suck so much, man. I hate it. What else can we do? It's almost seven. dark in here. It's too dark and depressing in here. Dad, I'm finished. Can I go watch TV? Oh no. What kind of homework is Dad? So let's go downstairs. Sean's done with his homework. So he's gonna go watch TV. But it's time for him to eat dinner. I can't get the pizza no more, so I guess he's not gonna eat. Let's, oh, Let let's me have a look. Pretty good. Looks like you're done. <laughs> Off you go. As long as it doesn't pass over 8 o'clock, which is his bedtime, uh, we are good to go. So it doesn't seem like I can get food anymore. And it's 7 12. Or 7 10. Or 11 12. So dinner. Where the frick is the dinner? I can't grab the pizza anymore. He ain't eating. He, I guess his snack was his dinner, right, guys? Or I'm a horrible dad. I get children killed and I don't feed them dinner. When will I stop? All uh, right, let's see what he. It's dinner time. I better make something for Sean. Okay. Am I allowed? No. Y'all not letting me open the refrigerator anymore. Why not? I can't, I can't get anything. No dinner for you, Sean. Uh, Come to think of it, if he's not asking for anything, it must be because he's not hungry. You've got a cold coming on. I'm going to see if I can find some medicine for you. How am I going to give him medicine before he, I mean, before he eats? I guess an apple is good enough. They usually, my parents usually tell me I can't take any medication unless I eat something. But an apple counts. Unless you need something heavy. I saw medication up here. No, 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 no. How dare you turn around while I'm talking. Yeah, there's some medication right here. I don't know if I'll be able to grab it. What the hell is that? Medication. Give him all of them. Get the hell out! Can we give him some medication? See if he, uh, he takes it. The little kids don't like to take medicine. Here, take this. It'll make you feel better. Thanks, Dad. You're, honey. you're, you're welcome, honey. Sonny, I mean... Grease has Sean this weekend. Seems like he can't wait to get back to his mother.
What do you say we play together for a while? I'd rather watch TV. Damn! Well then go to bed, bitch! Come on, Sean. It's time for bed. Oh, but I never go to bed this early. Go to bed! No, you're going to bed now. It won't do you any harm to go to bed early for you're once. You're mean! You just want me to get out of the way so you can have some peace! I hate you! What the fuck?! Are you serious? Just because I told you to go to bed early? I didn't, really, I didn't expect that. I don't think he's ever told me that. Like, that's weird. You little bitch. Where are you? Where are you? No, 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 no. What are you doing? Go back in there and whoop his ass. God damn it. Why does he hate me? I just told you to go to bed. I, I don't understand. Damn, that boy's gonna be crazy. He's gonna be a freaking killer when he grows up. There's nothing I can do, right? No. <coughs> Sorry, guys. I think he took some of those pills. How did that show up in my hand? This part kind of reminds me of Silent Hill a little bit, you know? Just the feel of it, the walk in the streets, no one there but monsters. Well, this one doesn't have monsters, but no one there. What? Touchpad, but access is control. This is a detective guy, a private investigator. Wait, is he a detective or a private investigator? I think he's a private investigator. This part's really, really cool. I like it a lot. Damn, he's that heavy. Did you see that car? Let's go inside. I forgot his name. No, 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 no. All right, let's go to the ch the office. Lauren Winter, ring any bells? Nope, can't say it does. You son of a bitch. Oh, that Lauren Winter. Third floor, last door you, on the left at the end of the corridor. You cheap mother okay, Come on, let's go. Lauren Winters, that's who we're gonna investigate and see who she is. <clears throat> I like checking every door though. Oh, someone's looking at me, that's awesome. What about this one? They're getting it on. I know what door it is, guys. I just want to hear the, the reactions of the other doors that I knock on. So he's looking at the one we're supposed to be on. No one answers his door anymore. Lauren Winter. Sorry, I only see clients by appointment. Oh, no, I missed. 
Fuck. It's 50 bucks. I don't kiss and I don't do any weird shit. Fine by me. your money on the table. You got exactly 10 minutes when the alarm rings, it's over, okay? All right, guys, I am going to start this video here. We are in Lauren Winter's apartment. I guess she's a prostitute, and we're going to investigate her story and see what she's all about. At the same time, investigate this in uh, private investigator, see why he's in this story and why he's in this gameplay and how does he connect with the overall video game guys anyways guys sorry that it's a short video i don't feel so well so uh hit me hit me with some likes in the bottom i really appreciate it leave me some comments guys of what you thought of this episode but like always it is albert six smith peace